Hi, I'm here with my good friend Mark Adams from the Mark Adams School of Woodworking to tell you about an opportunity that we're collaborating on in June of 2014 called Through the Narrow Gate with Mark Adams. But I thought better than me tell you, I'd have Mark tell you because this is really kind of his brainchild. So Mark, what do you have in your heart for us to do next year? Well, Bill, here's what's on my mind. What I'd like to do uh, through our workshops is offer a class the week of June 23rd through the 27th, 2014, a workshop where people get to experience three things. First of all, they get to come and they get to experience what it's like to make something in the shop by hand. Okay. No skill necessary, they can just come and spend some time. They're going to make some document boxes that are going to hold some pretty special things. One of the boxes will be theirs to keep and one of them is for them to give to somebody who's been really special in their life. The second thing that I'd like for them to uh, learn is I'd like for them to see a little bit about our facility and how things work there and, and experience what, it, what it's like to actually spend time making something. The third thing is spending time with you and your staff um, and see firsthand exactly what the young men from Narrowgate are doing. Yeah, that's, that's kind of our hope, and I know we've talked about this a lot, but my real dream is that people would actually be able to come and spend a week at your campus with us, but instead of hearing from you or hearing from me, that really at the end of the day, who they hear from is God. I love Bible study because I don't see it like other people see it. I don't read the text of Scripture like it's a task or a to-do that I have to put a check in the box and move on from. When those pages open up and I read those words, I can hear my dad. I, I can see and hear the face and voice of my father. And what the Spirit does to quicken or enliven, bring that word to life in my mind and in my heart is unexplainable. It's a gift. It's not something that I went to school to learn how to do. It's a gift just like God gifted you in woodworking. He gifted me to see things when I open those pages of Scripture. And I love nothing more than to take what He shows me and allow Him to show it to other people through me. That's what we're going to do during this class. So it's an opportunity for people to come and, and experience the Holy Spirit like you showed me. And for me to be able to take what I know about woodworking and show people what Jesus did with His hands in His lifetime.